fans need to appreciate and understand how badly both of these guys want it. Pitbull is so motivated to keep that belt. It's finally his, he doesn't want to give him up. Daniel Strauss lost his title. I know that haunts his dreams. Both of these guys want that belt so badly. Daniel Strauss versus the champ, Patricio Pitbull, for the 145 pound title. It's a huge fight, it's a rematch. They have fought before. Daniel Strauss, known for his wrestling, his ability to grind guys down. He's a giant at 145 pounds. But against Justin Wilcox in his last fight in Bellator, a knockout in the first round. He says, I'm a finisher now. I've changed up my game. There's no more five round decisions. Patricio Pitbull, a knockout puncher at 145 pounds. He has power that I think pound for pound, he's the hardest hitter in MMA. And it's short range power. Hard to take down and he hits hard. The difference in this fight is, will the weight cut take a lot out of Daniel Strauss? It's been tough before, he's had to shave his head to make it. Will he have the energy for a fourth round, a fifth round? I don't think he had the energy for the fifth round against Pat Curran, that's why he's not still the champion. Key to victory for Daniel Strauss is get the takedown going, get it going early and often, and make Pitbull work hard every single round. Don't let him take the round by hurting you, which is what he did against Pat Curran. He's able to hurt Pat Curran and take close rounds by showing damage. He can't do that. He has to decisively win every round. If you are Pitbull, avoid the takedown and hurt Daniel Strauss on the inside. Hurt him close when he's trying to put you against the fence and muscle you around. Hurt him with body shots, hurt him with hooks. Give him a reason to back off. He won the first fight because Daniel Strauss was hesitant to get inside and use his wrestling advantage. Follow that path to victory and keep your title.